Julie, I have been looking forward to this interview because in all the years I've been doing interviews, I have never had a chance to talk with you. And I'm particularly happy to talk with you on this occasion because SOB is an entirely different kind <laughs> of movie for you. I wonder, Julie, I, I can see the headlines now. Mary Poppins topless, you know, mm -hmm. yes, and I'm sure you can that. see them too. Yes. Uh, are you or have you been concerned about that thing and what it will do to your image with fans? Uh, not too concerned because it's a very good role and uh, I am an actress and I think if I worried terribly about my image it would be very foolish. I would constantly be doing uh, things like Mary Poppins and I'd never grow or I'd never expand or um, sort of uh, stretch my talents and so I think I, it would be rather dumb to just stay in one place. Hopefully one grows as one matures and this is a sensational role for any actress and I'm very glad to have had it. When you first became aware that that scene was going to be in the film which your husband Blake Edwards wrote, what was the very first reaction you had? Was it, oh goody, or was it, oh Blake? <laughs> A little bit of both, I think. It was written about 10 years ago, so I can't exactly remember my reaction, but uh, it probably was a mixture of both. And that was at a time when uh, probably Blake's lowest time in life, wasn't it? Yes, it was. He was very low. He'd, uh, um, we'd all moved, uh, the entire family had moved to Europe and um, just to kind of take stock and, and think about things. And I was working over there, it all happened to coincide very happily in spite of it being a very difficult time. But those of us who are wives, when we see our husbands the least bit disturbed about anything, we can't help but be affected by it. How did it affect you and how did it affect your marriage? Well, I'd seen with my own eyes the, the uh, problems that he'd been through on uh, three previous films before we moved to Europe and they were horrendous and I, uh, so I endorsed his move. I, I, I couldn't help but feel angry for him. Uh, and uh, I applauded his feeling to get away and get perspective. Uh, it was difficult, it was difficult on all the family, especially on the children, uh, and he, he did feel uh, very pressured and very angry himself about it all. But uh, I think he wrote his demons out with SOB and I think he's much the better for it now. Was there any time, Julie, when you felt that it was going to be a real threat to your marriage? Uh, the move or oh, his anger? The, no, his, his anger and the depression he was going through and all. Oh, I didn't feel it as a threat to the marriage. I, I was very concerned for Blake and what he was going through, but it didn't threaten our marriage at all. Julie, of course, your actress, singer, stage, movies, that's really what you love, isn't it? Um, it's a great deal of what I love. There are many other things I adore as well, but uh, yes, that's, that makes up a great part of my life. But then you get into all these behind-the-scenes hassles. That's what SOB is about. And now, in your real life, you're living these damnable things again. I think it's, uh, if you're going to be in this business, you have to expect an awful lot of that. It's part of what it's all about. There is a great deal of SOB in the uh, motion picture industry, and particularly, and, and I would say as only in the sort of upper levels of it. But. Um, but you're probably a little more privy to it than a lot of actresses would be because you're because married to the filmmakers. Yes, I think so. So uh, you get into it a little heavier than, than the ordinary actress would. Well, I see a lot more. I mean, I see uh, a great deal of, of things that go on behind the scenes, and uh, so I'm, I'm a witness. Julie, the, um, it's such a diatribe against the industry, and uh, with uh, a certain amount, uh, if not total, uh, justification, do you worry at all that there will be some sort of backlash and that this is going to backfire on Blake and on you as well? Uh, well, I'm very biased because I think it's a very good film and it's done with a great deal of humor. I mean, uh, I, I'm laughing at myself in the movie, Blake's laughing at himself and we're all, everybody in the film is laughing a little at the industry. The industry should laugh at itself too. It should have a sense of humor. Um, I, I think if it's a very fine film, and I believe it is, if the public accept it as that, there will be no backlash at all because it's truthful. And, uh, and it, uh, wh uh, while being truthful, as I just mentioned, is so funny and so adorable, I don't think you could be mad at that. 
Well, Julie, you have you, your fame from Mary Poppins and the Sound of Music can never be taken away from you, but now you're going to have another kind of fame, and I know you must be delighted. It is a fine performance. I enjoyed Thank you. it I'm very, glad you liked very it. much. Good. So nice to see you yes. and finally meet you, Julie. Okay, let's do it again soon. Thank you.